Especially the fact that I was all by myself and without anyone else. Hey guys, it's up, Sharmix. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I have something different. I have a story time of my dream. And my dream scared me in real life and in my dream. And I just had to share it with you guys because it had to do with Pokemon Go. And Pokemon Go is something I do upload on my channel. So, I want to explain this to you. It's just creepy and I have so many questions about this. And I hope you guys enjoy this video. So, let's just get started into the dream. So, how this dream started was with me looking for Pokemon at about 10 p.m. at night. And... First of all, there's so many things wrong with that, especially the fact that I was all by myself and without anyone else or no friends because Pokemon Go is obviously more fun when you play with friends and if you're going to play at really, really like dark night times and you're walking around, please bring a friend or someone or your mom, your dad, I don't know, Just it was just so wrong that like in this dream I was doing something that I wouldn't do in real life. And it was 10 and it was pitch dark like I couldn't see anything and then all of a sudden on my phone it's like you know when you see like a lure module whatever you want to go there because you know there's gonna be good Pokemon there so I was like okay I'm gonna go here and then nine more stops like so there was 10 in total popped up beside this one lure thing that I was going to so I was like okay that's kind of weird because it wasn't there in the first place but they all had lures on them and you can see Everyone is running to this like 10 pack of lured pokey stops and it's all in one radius so like if you stand in the middle you can reach all the pokey stops so like everyone is running there there's so many people like I said it was pitch black so you couldn't really see people's faces you can obviously tell that there was someone like a group of people at least a hundred people running to the stop and it was just crazy so I'm like okay I might as well go it would be perfectly fine I'm with a hundred other people playing Pokemon Go. This is weird because I have been to places with like a bunch of stops that always have lures on them. At this one place, I vlogged there in my second Pokemon Go video, I believe. There's like three Poke stops that you can actually all reach in one, like if you stand like right in the middle of them. And like there's always a lot of people there, there's always lures on them, which is weird because this dream kind of reminds me of that place. Even though it looked nothing like it, but I mean, Everyone's always there. If it's dark, you probably won't be able to see anyone's faces. As for me, I was standing on a hill, which is first of all wrong, just in case anything happens, which something did happen in the stream, and I was standing behind a bush. And the bush is also a bad idea, because if I have to run, I'm not gonna run through the bush, because that's kind of like really hard to do. And I was just playing, I was getting all my stops, and then I heard someone scream. And this is like, this is like a horror movie for me, a 2016 Pokemon Go horror movie, and I just can't even, I, I couldn't even like in my dream I woke up when I woke up I was like so done I swear there was tears going down my face so like I was saying I heard someone scream put your hands up and I was like wait like is there a cop here like they don't know what we're doing like you don't have Pokemon Go you don't see these 10 Pokestops all beside each other I thought it was like just a normal thing a cop was coming telling everyone to put their hands up because they thought something was going on it was not a cop so then I saw the gun glare and like just the little bit of moonlight that we had the gun was shiny it was like a pistol or something I don't even know it was some random guy and he shot the gun and I saw sparks fly out of the gun and I was like oh my god everybody screaming this is all I can hear an innocent person dropped dead and I'm telling you when I see a dead person anywhere like in a video or like in my dream like in my head like i can't wake up from this dream because like it's one of those things that where your body like makes you sleep i just can't even it was an innocent person playing pokemon go dead on the floor and i know there's things that's happened like this like people like falling off cliffs people crashing people dying because of pokemon go but i saw it i know it's a dream so don't comment down below like calm down i know it's a dream whatever and at this point i'm like i gotta get out of here like i'm gonna die I need to leave, I'm all alone, I have no one with me. Then I turned, I'm on a hill, remember that, by a bush, I turn to run, and this gunman points his pistol or whatever he's holding at me, and he goes, put your hands up. So, obviously I'm gonna put my hands up because I don't wanna die, like he's gonna shoot me. I put my hands up and I'm standing there, and this guy goes, I'm, I already have my hands up, like I'm already listening to what he wants from me, like I don't know what he, what you want. He still shot his gun, but thank God this guy missed 
the first time he shot me. At this point, all I'm hearing is like screaming from everyone, girls, boys, like all I'm hearing is gunshots too. This guy's going around just shooting the crowd. I don't know how he has so many bullets. It's a dream, I know. All I'm hearing is shooting and screams and that's just already a nightmare and all in itself but when you're the one getting pointed at with a gun it's even worse after he tries to shoot me the first time he miss i try to make a break for it i try to run i have to run up a hill which is harder i can't run that fast up the hill he goes and shoots me again he misses me but i'm so weak from crying my eyes out i just plop on the floor right behind that bush so he can't really see me from where he's standing but i was i just I couldn't even like stand up anymore. I was crying so hard. I just saw so many people die in front of my face. So then I just like, pl I plowed. But I guess he thought I was dead. So thank God. So we turned around and started shooting other people, which is not still not okay. At this point, there's probably like 20 dead bodies that I could see in my dream. And that's really creepy because that's dead people in my dream. I slowly get up to run because I still need to leave. This guy's still here shooting people. I don't know why the police aren't here yet. Was my, I was his target. I do not know why I was his target. So I slowly get up and he sees me and he's like, that, there's that girl that fell. I don't know. And he goes and shoots me again. This is the third time he sh shot me and I'm making this very over dramatic, but it was a really scary dream. He goes and he shoots me a third time. This time he doesn't miss again, but it does skim my arm, which means it does hit me. And it did hurt because whoosh, like a bullet going really fast in my arm, burnt my arm. And yeah, I had like a mark on my arm and I was just crying. And it just completely stopped shooting me and he started shooting other people. I go home and I am petrified. I do not even want to go outside anymore ever when it's dark. This just scared me. Like I was like, oh my God, is this real life? Until I woke up, obviously I knew it wasn't real life. But I was like at home, I was crying, I was petrified. I was like, I'm gonna, when I go outside, there's gonna be someone who wants to shoot me. Someone wants to kill me. Like I cannot go outside in the dark anymore. I can't see anyone in the dark. I'm not gonna go in the dark. <laughs> I have just a couple questions about this dream that honestly, like I woke up thinking about these questions and I was like, I want answers. So obviously I'm not gonna get answers. One of my questions is why did this man make me his target and who was this man? Because I couldn't see his face, obviously it was dark. Why was I his target? Like why did he only want to kill me? Like I don't know what I did wrong. I also have another question as to why he shot three bullets and none of them killed me because that is like you had three chances and i was standing in one spot the whole time but he missed me so i don't know if that was jesus christ helping me i don't know what what that's supposed to mean but i don't know why it didn't kill me i want to know if anyone else in this world had this dream at the same time as me because like i said there was over 100 people in it i know that doesn't mean it's real people i know it's probably people i saw in the past but i want to know if anyone actually had the same dream as me and was in that dream and they play pokemon go like me and if they're scared now i don't know i just want to know like do, do you ever think like Oh, I wonder if that person was dreaming about me too. Another question is, why are people so disgusting? Why are guns even a thing? I shouldn't be dreaming about guns. I shouldn't even know what a gun is. Guns shouldn't even be real. There's so much violence in this world that I just heard so much of it that it just came into my dream because if violence wasn't a thing, if guns weren't a thing, this dream would never came to my head. It would have been all flowers and nature and everyone playing around, but no, this world is sick. So thanks guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to hear more of my dreams, let me know down below. Don't forget to leave a like on this video and I'm out.